What's up guys? We are currently here in Senyuji Temple in Kyoto, Japan. The name of the temple means bubbling spring. For centuries, Senyuji was a mortuary temple for the aristocrats and the imperial house. Located here are the official tombs of the Emperor Shijo and many of the emperors who came after him. Senyuji was founded in the early Heian period. According to one tradition, it was founded in 855 at the former mountain villa. According to another tradition, this temple was a reconstruction of an earlier temple which has been founded during the Tenchu era. 1824-1834. Walking farther up the hill brings the visitor to the Diamond Gate and the ticket office to enter the main Senju Temple complex. Inside to the left is the small shrine Yokihi Kanon, a small temple dedicated to the Chinese consort Yang Weifei. Yang Weifei is the beautiful concubine of the last Tang Emperor Hu Xuanzun. Yang Weifei's beauty was such that the Emperor contrived to free her from her marriage to his son and take her as his own concubine. From then on, letting things of state fall into ruins in his blind devotion to her. The Emperor's negligence led to a rebellion, whereby he was forced to have Yang Hui Fei strangled as part of his punishment. He later regretted it and sought to contact her via a Taoist priest in the underworld. After Yang Hui Fei's death, the distraught emperor is said to have had her immortalized in the statue of the Canon Buddha. Legend has it that the priest Tan Kai brought the cypress wood statue back from China, though this is probably unlikely. The temple is popular with young Japanese women who come to pray for some of Yang Kuei-Fei's fabled beauty. After finishing the shrine, I went down the slope and I found the huge Chinese-style Butsuden or main hall. Inside is a three seated images of Buddha. The ceiling was painted by the celebrated Edo period Kanu Tani of the Kanu School of Artists. Around the temple there are other buildings which included the spirit hall with the cedar bark roof recalling the Goshen Imperial Palace in central Kyoto and the Sheridan, which holds memorial tablets of the deceased emperors, consorts, princes, and princesses. The major buildings in Senyuji were reconstructed and enlarged in the early 13th century by the monk Shunjo. Neither building is open to the public, so I can only see the outside of the building. There are also imperial tombs located on the temple grounds, which unfortunately I didn't have the time to visit. I didn't went to look at those places. For me, my journey is now over and now it's time for me to go back to the city. Until next time guys, goodbye.